Alright, before I get into this video, I just want to say, yes, I know, Star Wars has come out. Well, Solo Star Wars Joy has come out, and yes, I still want to see it, and yes, I have heard about the box office records, but it doesn't mean that it's actually going to necessarily flop-flop. Uh, and uh, I do not care what it, what the people are saying about this film, um, even though it is getting good reviews, but, uh, but yes, I really seriously want to go see it, so... A friend of mine might be taking me to see it, or if he sees the movie again, because he thought it was awesome. So, if he does, I will give a give a review. Also, I do not want to miss this movie in theaters at all. Oh, because why not? It's a freaking Star Wars movie. I'm a I'm a super mega fan of of those movies. Um. So anyway, like, like I said before, I did mention I was gonna do a spoiler review for, well, a spoiler video for Deadpool. So spoilers. Um. And so, in the beginning part of the film, um, 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 uh, what do you call it? Vanessa gets killed, oh, because, uh, right, I mean, uh, Wade Wilson was try trying to stop the bullets and stuff, and then he tried to stop the bullet from reaching to, uh, to Vanessa, but it was too late. Then, on the, uh, the song, on from Celine Dion pops on, on called, um, uh, um, Ashes, and, and it, of course, it's a great song, and the trip, and the, um, uh, uh, they did the same kind of trick from the first film, um, where it actually has like fourth wall breaking credits, uh, and it's still pretty hilarious. Uh, um, and it also and also the credits kind of make fun of um, on the uh, the saw sequence like in uh, in your tip in your uh, James Bond movie, I mean, like like for example like the one in Spectre, you know, like in uh, Skyfall or Spectre for example. Oh yeah, it's it is actually really cool to see some. Unlike that in the movie, because the way they shot it is really brilliant. Um, <clears throat> what do you call it? Oh, and, uh, Deadpool becomes a trainee, like for the X Men, and then these care, and then the characters were all going on like trainee, whatever he's like saying X Men. I'm an X Men trainee. Oh yeah, Ed. it's it's so hilarious. So um, oh, uh, what do you call it? So, Deadpool does try to actually, like, kill himself a couple times because he wants to be with, um, oh, Vanessa, but he, she's saying that his heart needs to be in the right place, and he will actually do that, uh, later on in the film. There's a kid, like I said before, named, named, um, oh, named Russell, oh, I think his name, oh, yeah, Russell, oh, well, I can actually say Fire Fist. Oh, and like I said before, he's actually, I actually really like the character Fire Fist, I thought he was a pretty cool character. And, uh, he's one of the characters that, uh, a Deadpool will actually ha will actually care for, like, his own, uh, like, a friend or his own son. And then, uh, uh, there's this prison scene, like I said, like I did mention the other, uh, a week ago. Oh, that did kind of drag on a bit. Or well, just for a few minutes, just like the, uh, the casino scene in The Last Jedi. Oh, yeah, but, um. Uh, and, uh, they hear the strange noise coming in on oh, one of the prison cells all the then oh, when Wade Wilson escapes from prison with uh, uh from with cable or oh, when they're like doing this big fight scene or something when uh, the little boy oh he Russell is still in prison oh, and then he goes to that big per to that big person and he talks to him and then when the the um uh the x force gets wait, well the x force gets formed up uh, they fall out of the plane, and then, um, on the, the Thunderstruck song from ACDC plays, which is an awesome song, although, um, everyone is falling down, and then, on, um, you're not gonna believe this, but, almost all of them die. But the only ones that were still alive were, um, oh, it was, uh, oh, what was, I mean, damn it, I forgot the guy's name. I'm... My like Dave, I think it was. Oh, no, Peter, Peter. Oh, and he, uh, uh, his arm gets like cut off for some reason. Um, but uh, I don't want to go too much. But it's so hilarious. But the rest of the death scene is so funny. Of course, the only one that does survive is Domino. Um, there's a really cool truck chase scene in the movie. Oh yeah, and, um, oh, and they get into a crash and. On um, the guy that was in the prison turned out to be Juggernaut. On oh, and I am not kidding. 
on when I saw her, I'm like, what? When I saw his hand popped out, and then when I saw his mouth, I'm like, oh my god, Juggernaut! But, I mean, this is not the first time I've seen him, <clears throat> uh, because he was in X-Men 3, The Last Stand. And, on for what, I mean, uh, he has this, he has the accent, he has the cool design, unlike in the comics, it was really cool to see him in this movie. So, uh, he rips apart Deadpool in half, off of that, on, uh, remember that joke in the first film, on where, uh, he had, on when he cut his hand off from, uh, escaping from Colossus? Oh, it's like, he was just nice to cut his arm off, like, and, uh, he was, like, saying, ever seen 127 hours? Spoiler alert. Oh, and he goes, oh, well, pardon my language, or oh, we're not, on the, uh, the blood spat all over, uh, Colossus' face, saying, oh, there's the money shot, baby. Like, well, pardon my language, but that's what he said in the movie. But, um, it was kind of similar to that. Uh, but here's the thing. Like, it wasn't a baby hand. Baby legs. And, oh my god. Oh, it was all CG. Oh, yeah, and, uh, as he was, like, tur as was he was, like, turning his thing, like, I just will say, like, like, I won't say the P word, but it was CGI genitalia. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, when that happened. When that happened, and when I saw that, I'm like, no, 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 no. Oh, I get it. I get it. That's supposed to be an R-rated film. Oh, and I try not to say the P-word or something, um, because we already know what it is. But, but, but it was just one second. I will admit, it was just a one simple second of that scene. Oh, and that was really just. That was kind of disturbing. Again. It was still funny, but still, oh man, oh my god. But uh, they do uh, find the, but uh, anyway, Cable joins forces with them, of course. Or oh, then they make a deal with each other. Or oh, that Deadpool can be able to, or to uh, talk to the kid and stuff to make him be good again. Or oh, and the climax, of course, was a ton of fun. On oh, that. And, um, after the climax, Deadpool was, like, slowly dying. Oh, and then he's making these kind of jokes and stuff, and it's so hilarious. And then they go, and then he does die, and then go, oh, see, uh, what's her name? All right, but then, on Cable, I'll use his time arm, um, and travel back through time on the Star Lover again or something. It, and then, uh, Cable decided to stay in, oh, yeah, in their time, which is really cool. And, uh, I went up, and that's pretty much it, except from the post credit scene. And I'm gonna say, the post credit scene is by far some of the funniest crap you'll ever want to see. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, well, first off, <clears throat> of, uh, on Deadpool, oh, I was, like, talking to a uh, Negasonic Teenage Warhead, on, and, his, and her girlfriend, and... When uh, they give him the when, uh, a time I mean, machine as well. well, well, a time arm, whatever you call it, or a time watch or something, and then travels back in time, I to make sure that uh, Vanessa doesn't get killed, uh, and then he's like, "We're well, definitely naming our kids here!" Wow! Oh, that was hilarious, and on and then there was a clip. Above um of X Men Origins Wolverine, which is still the worst X Men movie of all time. I am, and then on oh, they show the original shot of Deadpool in there, or uh, and then after he, he uh, after uh, oh, uh, he gets out the claws. Uh, Deadpool shoots the other Deadpool in the head. Uh, and he's like, it's okay, it's just me. I'm right, trying to fix time. I grab this gun, shoots the uh, thing a few times like this. Okay, well, choose the other, or the crappy Deadpool, or like this. Oh, I, I pissed myself laughing at that. Uh, the other part that made me pissed out laugh. I well, made me piss myself. Well, not piss, piss myself, but, but it was so hilarious. Yes, um, it shows us Ryan Reynolds of looking at the script for uh for Green Lantern, and he's like, "Welcome to the big leagues, kid." Boom! Shoots him right through the head, and the blood splatters all over the freaking script. Um, and then his final words were, and then uh, Deadpool's words, as were like, 
You're welcome, Canada. And that's it. That that was freaking it. Oh my god. Like I said before, I super love this movie. It's still the funniest movie I've ever seen, along with the first film since the uh, the Ted movies. Right, so, of course you have seen it. What did you personally think about the film? Uh, just comment below. Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Stardust. Don't forget to subscribe to my page. And I am the Bostonian Critic, and I will see you later on. Take care.